Here's the solution. Notice the small dashboard footprint. We've incorporated a button with a built-in bicolor LED and a nice little attractive package on the dashboard. A piezo buzzer is located behind the dashboard where it doesn't take up any dashboard real estate. So here's how it works. You press the momentary button and a red light comes on to indicate that the power is on, but there's no water coming out. If there's no water in the bilge, then the bilge pump will turn off automatically and the red light will turn off. If there is water in the bilge, a green light will come on to indicate that water is actually coming out of the bilge pump system. The pump will stay on as long as water is being detected by the flow sensor. There's no need to lean overboard or to leave the boat to find out if water is coming out of the bilge pump. You can just see it right on the dashboard. If you have a lot of water in the bilge, and it takes more than 20 seconds to pump out, then a max flow alert will occur. The piezo buzzer will beep and the red and the green lights will blink back and forth. This indicates that you have a large leak in the boat and you should do something about it. You can keep your automatic bilge pump switch, whether it's a float switch or one of the new electronic switches. The show flow systems operate right on top of it and doesn't interfere with the normal operation of the bilge pump systems. It has a high impedance interface that will not affect the operation of your bilge pumps. If your bilge pump does come on automatically, but no water comes out, the show float system detects this and initiates a no flow alert. It does this with an audible beeper and a blinking red light. This indicates that there's probably a clog in your bilge pump or maybe your bilge pump is seized up. It's not working. No other system has this particular alarm. No other system has the capability because they don't have an integrated flow sensor. The system also shows how many times the bilge pump was activated while you're away from the boat. Press the button twice and it blinks the number of times the bilge pump was activated since it was reset. You can also check if there was a problem by pressing the button three times. If there was no problem, then the light will not blink. If there was a problem, for instance, if you had a max flow or no flow alert while you were gone, then the light will blink red and green to indicate that there is some problem with your bilge pump system and you really should check it out. Now I can rest easy knowing the condition of my bilge and my bilge pump. It's always better to know the condition of every part of your boat. But the most important part of your boat is the ability to keep it above water.